Yet another initiative that speaks to public assistance for the most vulnerable while fostering increased collaboration between neighboring Martinique and St. Lucia has taken place. On June 24, 2023, officials of the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment were delighted to welcome on island a seven-member French delegation comprising students and a teacher from the Edward Glasshaw College, as well as a parent and members of the Rivier Salé Lions Club. The middle school Edward Glisson has participated in this solidarity collection in partnership the Lions Club. Thanks to the eco-delegates, the school has collected 659 glasses. This is our class which has got the biggest number with 149 glasses. It's, it's a, a real, real pleasure, pleasure to, to offer, offer you the collection. collection. We are hoping that this initiative will be an encouragement for other young people within the Martinique or French territories, as well as our own St. Lucia and the wider Caribbean region. Students of Edouard Glisset College and the Lions Club, we commend you again for your most valuable initiative and trust that this will not be the last of your good deeds to impact the Blind Welfare Association and the general poor community and indigent in St. Lucia. The primary objective of the visit was to facilitate the official handover of recycled eyewear generously donated by the French territory to the St. Lucia Blind Welfare Association via the Ministry of Equity. The donation includes a collection of 2,200 pieces of eyewear encompassing glasses, sunglasses and frames. I want to say thank you uh, for um, uh, Con Consular of St. Lucie in Martinique to, to, uh, to listen to us, uh, to receive uh, us in, in St. Lucie, and uh, to uh, m make this, uh, um, uh, th this meet. We are asking for opportunities. Opportunities not only to enjoy the good of society, but also to contribute to the continuing development of this society, and by extension, the Caribbean because we feel we belong. Blindness can affect anybody from at all age. You can, you can born with the condition and you can become blind at any time. So, our program try to in, encompass the whole um, age stru uh, spectra so structure from age zero to well over a hundred. Minister Honorable Joachim Henry expressed gratitude to the French delegation and Lynx Optical Center of Martinique for spearheading the commendable initiative. Savle di même sou malade, même sou ka mort, l'ani moun ki vivan, ki ka y kontine. Avec nou ni pou kontine fe by moon ki vivan sa nou sa, même si nou malad, même si nou kamon. Me ki moun ki epontan fasyon sa la, se sa ka vini deye, avek mwen ka wi mesye se mamay la, paske nou ni pou kontine fe kon nou, an po kote nou sa, loje kon nou yo sa pase, e kontine twa bay la ki nesese. The ceremony provided an opportunity for both nations to celebrate the spirit of cooperation and exchange, strengthening the long-established bonds of friendship between St. Lucia and the French territories. The St. Lucia Blind Welfare Association remains committed to improving the lives of visually impaired individuals on St. Lucia through various programs and initiatives. Meantime, the Ministry of Equity continues to foster an enabling environment for the creation of opportunities for collaboration that causes those who have to touch the lives of those who have not.